Sonia Sordo makes a shocking discovery as she walks outside her Sweetwater apartment just before noon. The body of what appears to be a female, fully clothed, face down, dumped in a grassy area in her apartment complex's parking lot. Sordo says next to the body, a newspaper. And on top of the newspaper... A flower, a red rose that. A red rose next to the body. That's what it was. I said she had long hair up to here. She had black jeans on and a black t-shirt on up to here. Any message that you saw at all on the body? Anything written no. on the body? No, nothing. It was a rose? It was a rose. Never before. Never. We've never seen that person before. Not a resident then? No. It's a sight becoming all too familiar to cops. Just last Sunday, just two miles away from here, the body of 23-year-old Charity Nava found dumped, the killer leaving a message on Nava's back. October 8th, the body of Elisa Martinez found strangled and dumped. September 17th, the body of Lazaro Comisada also found strangled, also dumped in Southwest Dade. Police believe all three of those cases are linked. All three are prostitutes. The question now, is this number four? We can't determine anything at this part of the investigation that would positively lead us to believe that this has anything to do with any other homicide in Dade County.